Hi, bonjour. My name is Dr. Andia Augustine Billy, and I just finished teaching a course in St. Mary in Paris with my colleague, Dr. Dina Kress, on Paris Noir, African Americans in the City of Light. Now, this course is about how African Americans in 20th century went to Paris and sought refuge there when things were not so cool here in America. Throughout the course, the students not only learn about this uh, neglected aspect of our history, but they also discovered about themselves, their own history, and also about Paris. Hi, I'm Samantha Padilla, and I'm a freshman here at the Centenary College of Louisiana. I've traveled abroad before, and to do it again in a place like Paris was an extremely incredible opportunity that I greatly appreciate being a part of. My class was the Perry Noir class with uh, Dr. Abe and Dr. Cress and they were incredible teachers by far. They knew what they were doing and it was, I felt very safe in their hands. Um, the class itself was very interesting in the sense that it was about black America and their ties to France that were born here but couldn't find couldn't gain the same rights as everyone else, especially during the times of the civil rights movement and before that. And so most of them ended up going to France as their refuge. In the end, France became their alternate America. And when they went there, they gained equal rights. They gained a sense of belonging and a sense of self which is something that when people come to America, they come to find, they come to find themselves. We would all just sit down in these places that were so filled with history and we would hear the lectures from Dr. Kress and Dr. Abe about how influential that people from America would make these places and how, how influential it was to be there and to practice what they preached and what they believed in there. So much to tell, so much to learn, so little time. We, only, we were only there for two weeks, but we covered as much as we could and to get as much as I got out of that, that's something that I honestly would regret if I had not done Centenary in Paris or had not even enrolled in this school. I'm, I'm very glad to be here, to be able to learn from these professors that know what they're doing, that have a passion for what they're teaching just as much as I have a passion for learning about what they're teaching. Um, there's not many places that can give you that, that shared compassion for a kind of education that is honestly much needed. I hope to take whatever I learn here and whatever I come across, whatever connections, relationships that I make here, and use them to help me better shape not only myself, but whoever I come in contact with in the future.